Right, today's little episode is on injury prevention for knees for kids who ski. Now we've got Jess who's going to show us what to do today. And this is one of the last drills we use in our ski fit class and it's called the ladder drills. Now you guys can do this at home. With a ladder like this you can actually just draw on the concrete with some chalk. But today we've got some ladder and we're going to do three drills to help improve kids who ski to get strong with their knees and in the future when they get older get some injury prevention going. So for Jess, what we're gonna do is a side step. Now when she side steps, we've gotta make sure bringing your foot forward for me. When she side steps, she's learning to not let her knee roll inwards. That's the big thing we don't want happening. So if you watch her, she's gonna do a side step all the way up and all the way down. So if we come from there, so if you come in here for me, Corny, and where we go. So do that one we were doing before, and you go all the way out and all the way back, where you go. There you go. So you can see with her, she's good with her landing, she doesn't let her knee roll in, and she's pretending like she's going around gates. Come all the way back. So this one's really crucial for her to stay wide, stay slow, stay controlled with each step, landing on her toes. And great, and I'll do about three or, four, <laughs> three or four sets of that, up and down, until she's a little bit fatigued. This is a really good ACL injury prevention one, where she is trying to not let her knee roll in when she jumps laterally. So if you come forward for me, just again, she's not allowed to let her knee roll in, or let her hip drop, but she's gonna go from one foot, she's gonna come out laterally, back to the centre, over immediately, and then back to the centre, and then change legs, okay? So you go there for me, Jess. So it's out, in, out, in, and then she changes legs. Out, in, out, in. And like I said, this is really easy. It's like hopscotch for these kids. And so if you draw it on the ground, they'll get to know how to do it. Just gotta make sure it's slow, controlled. She lands, stabilizes with every one. Out, in. Good, and then right one. And just change left and right. She's always doing left and right, left and right. Out, in, out, in, brilliant. All right, and then our last drill, come back down here, is our jump and land. Because when kids land, they've got to make sure they land with a bend in the knee and a bend in the hip. And a lot of kids land just with the straight knee, okay? Now if they keep doing that until adulthood, they might start running into problems with knee injuries in the future. So we've gotta make sure when they land on one leg, they're stable, they don't roll their knee in, and they actually sit down, use their glute. So for Jess, you're gonna go all the way up on one, okay? Land, jump two. Can you do that for me? All right, so jump two and land, where you go. Good, that's it, jump two. That's it, jump two. And jump two. Okay, now come back on the left leg. Okay, jump two. Land, hold. Jump two. Land, hold. That's it. Jump two. Land, hold. And jump two. Okay. Now she's pretty good, but if you practice this yourself and get your kids to practice this, you should do really well with some injury prevention. See you next time.